hello and welcome back to Taz Wells 12 you are back on my YouTube channel which is Taz Wells 12 I am the host who is Tara Wells and today's video is going to be a, another Poundland haul they're in my little green bag little goodies I will show you them in a moment but before we get on into the video I just want to go through the nitty-gritty stuff first which is if you like the video or any of the products i do or any of the advice i do give then please do give it a massive thumbs up because then i know that you like the video i then know that you the right content and we can bring more to you so give that video a big thumbs up if this is your first video that you are watching from me then you are more than welcome to come and subscribe to Taswell's 12 you do that by hitting the subscribe button you can then join the little youtube journey which is going on in me and then you can also see other videos i've done get through them they're more than interesting you will see why i've got a different background and also you will then come Come and join the little love family I have got going on here too. So if you're already existing subscriber, then thank you very much. It means the absolutely world to me. Thank you very much. Please comment down below and I will 100% comment back. You can comment back any, anything in the video. I will 100% comment back and we can have a little conversation. I want to say the last thing is that I am not sponsored by Poundland. This is all out of my own money and stuff that we needed for this house or for us it's just an advice video and to show you guys what's going on in Poundland and some new little bits or existing good bits but before anything I don't want to ramble anymore because I've gone on quite a bit yes yeah, so I'm not sponsored and let's get on into the Poundland video I haven't got my receipt today I have somewhere in the house but I haven't got it with me today because most of the items are normally existing from another Poundland haul but like I said if you're new you might not have seen them um, so they're really really good bits that I like and we've bought quite a bit of um, so I pretty much know the price and there's a couple of new ones that I will know the price too so if I am ever wrong then I will grab my receipt again. The first item we're going to start with is this. I'll bring it closer as you can see we are on a different angle today I just want to explain we are in a different room of my house I am trying to change up the little background for you guys just so you can see the sort of decor but also so I can sort of move around and it makes the videos a little bit interesting the light is really good in here as well so this is the first time we got and this was a bit more than pounds so this was actually two pounds but this stuff is amazing we have just moved in a new build as you probably saw in one of the videos and we had our garden turf down because obviously turf is on top of like normal soil you need to get it going obviously all the rain at the moment is really really helping it but there were some odd little patches that was like a bit sparse or the grass was not growing or it didn't have enough nutrients to grow this is absolutely fabulous and this is the cheapest that i found we have actually gone for a bottle of this already and it is the dofe since 1946 complete lawn feed weed and moss killer it feeds your lawn it kills moss it kills weeds and it thickens your lawn it covers up to 30 a square meter there is one kg in here and it's just absolutely fabulous for two pounds this stuff is great so this is our third bottle that we've got now i think i will probably get some more we will go through a lot of this in the summer because what you would normally do obviously when we get to the nicer days and the summer days if your grass is looking a bit sparse then put this on and um, if it's raining the day, that night or something then just let it rain and that can water your garden but also, if you put this on and then say you're getting a good spell of sunshine, just go out there and water your garden where you've put the stuff, just to give it that extra bit. It's great and we will probably be buying more of this. So, like I said, if you ever want your grass to look really green and long and grow lovely for the summer, then this is what you need. 
on that note about the grass is greener we actually have got some little patches of dirt or where this like the turf is not growing so i bought this as a new one so this was really good for its price as well so this was only a pound by the way i haven't actually tried this yet this is a total new box so if this is great i will be telling you and i will be buying more this is the speedy seed amazing value for 250g it's ultra patch it's rapid repair mixture before and after so that's what your grass looks like it's sparse and then it's supposed to look really nice shake rake and water so from march to october so it's about time to do it but we're just gonna have a go at this because we there's a patch there's odd little patches around our patio that the grass is just not growing i've put that like that greener stuff on there just to make the up previous grass grow but it's it's not doing it we saw this in poundland and i thought you know what i'm literally going to do this it tells you how to do it it's a special mix to repair your lawn it's doggy friendly lawn so that's really great for like knowing if you have a dog because that's really interesting space for cats as well any animal it's like really safe and then it just tells you how to do it on the back but this for a pound if this is great as well i would be buying some more of these because I know we've got into the boring stuff if that's what you like to call it, but this is what happens when you have a house and we want to have lovely grass for the summer to look really nice and we can go and sit out in there. We've got some of that. This is another old fave and this is great. If I could find it in a big bottle, then I would be absolutely happy, but unfortunately Poundland don't do it. I did check somewhere else, they don't do it and I've checked some other places. And unfortunately they don't do it i don't know why because it would be so great and me and neil use this and it is this listerine bottle and i don't know if you can see it so this is a tiny bottle this is the problem we like we go through this very very quickly and at a pound it is not the greatest as like buys but it is great the flavor it doesn't burn your mouth it's just fabulous so this is the listerine mint and green tea milder taste mouthwash removes up to 97 percent of germs left behind after brushing zero alcohol that's what you want because that does not burn your mouth but does the same effect of getting all the little grubby bits out of your teeth and making a fresh breath there's only 250 ml here but this is the greatest taste it literally does not give you a horrible aftertaste it is just blinking great in our eyes i was using it first i picked it up because i'm burning my mouth with this shrine and i was like no i don't want that anymore so i found this in poundland just off the off chance and i started using it and i said to neil do you know what that one from like poundland that's the like the mint and green tea one is fab and he's been starting using it and he really likes it honestly it's great it's perfect just it needs to be in a bigger bottle that's the only problem with it next item is another existing item and it is these so, um, so this is the washing up liquid i picked off the off chance in poland and i love it because it's in this snazzy little bottle and it's really like like do you know what I mean? like snazzy it's really really good it's really easy to use and it's just not taking up loads of room it's probably not the greatest for money but we absolutely love this we have gone about to through about two or three bottles of this since we've been here i know that's a lot of washing up we do a lot of washing up we have just got a sink to do the washing up we haven't got a dishwasher it's just what we didn't want so maybe in the future we will but we're washing up all of our dishes this is good washing up liquid it is just fab so this is from easy limited edition just hang in there says this off washing up liquid removes grease like magic it's 500 ml the smell of this it's just like tropical it's just honestly it's great it smells nice when you put it in your like your sink or warm water the smell comes out it foams up so lovely it foams up so good it's just the greatest thing so i picked up another two 
because we've got only one spare at the moment. I don't know if they're stopping this, which is going to be so sad because they did a, originally have a pink, a blue and a green, but the green's are best. But they're, these are on the back shelf. They're not with everything else. So I don't know if easier like bringing new ones out or a new bottle out or the fact is that Pamela just can't get hold of them. This I picked another two up and we'll go with this for the moment and then if we run out of this we might have to get something different which i'm going to be so sad because this works perfectly but yeah if you ever see this please do pick it up it smells amazing this was another gem i found well actually i'm not gonna say that i found it it was my mum that found it literally great so she just saw it on the off chance basically this item in a different brand in a different store can be like three four pounds we saw this and i was like i've already got one that was on offer i think i got it from like b m or home bargains and literally that's good for that price but when we saw this i was like this is even better my mum was like we're gonna check if this is a pound at the till and it was and the pr item is like she said she doesn't know how good this is gonna be he picked up one anyway because she wanted another one and then i said i'm gonna pick one up because at the end of the day this is great value for a pound this is insane for amount of money for that so this is the mighty oven cleaner fume free and the kit contains a bottle bag and gloves cleans inside the oven transform racks and grills 330 ml in here and obviously it gives you instructions on the back of what to do but this for a pound and if it works is gonna be our go-to because literally them other ones are so expensive like three to four pounds we like well you can get it for about two to three pounds right which is quite a good amount of money and we thought that was and it works so if this works and this is only a pound, this is a great little extra one because you could buy two of these for two pound where you're getting the other one for a pound. I don't know how many milliliters there is in the other ones, but this was a find. We were looking around the cleaning bits. I found this and I've got so many bottles I really did not need to pick up. So I picked two of these up and I used it the other day. I absolutely love it and I love the smell and it's just right up my street, but I really did not need to pick it up. And it was this. I'll try and explain it in a minute because it's very hard to see with the light, but you can see the cute little pictures. This is from Fabulosa. Fabulosa bring out amazing smells. It is crazy. I was actually looking for the Sephora winter morning winter morning i was trying to look for in sephora and they haven't got any more of that i love that smell i've picked up three boxes of it when it was there in poundland but it's the best smell but unfortunately they're not going to do it anymore because it's obviously not winter time so we may have to get some more boxes of that nearer that time i saw this and i looked at the label and it said banana <gasps> oh my god it's banana wow like i love that smell if you love banana smells this is great it's from fabulousa concentrated disinfectant and it's in banana llama that's why you've got these little llamas on and little banana pictures on it it's cute as anything makes 10 liters kills 99.99 bacteria cleans and shines eliminates odors long lasting freshness 220 ml in here this is fab this fa smells like foam bananas foam banana smell in a disinfectant is great so what i used it was i will do a cleaning video when we've like sorted it in a little bit more but what i did was about put about three capfuls of this in hot water i put them boiling water in from the kettle and the smell just came out of the kitchen and into the kitchen and it just smelled lovely so once the water goes like once the smell has gone round and it still does for ages once the water goes like a bit lukey warm that you can put your hands in i literally get a fiber cloth and go around the whole kitchen clean perfect stuff 
you can clean it it makes the kitchen smell fab it is fab loose like that is what it is because i've got cherry i've got loads of scents of these but this one i could not resist of getting too bored of love by the way if you don't like this new sort of look and i'm too far away please tell me because I can only learn of what I'm doing because I'm trying to get the goodness of the light to go in, but trying to show you the products as well. So tell me if I'm not showing you enough or not giving you enough advice or anything like that. Just comment down below because it helps me out for the next video. And the next item, this is gonna be so random. And I actually wanted one of these, but I did not think I was gonna go in Poundland to find it. And it is this this is just like a little grabber machine like grabber machine they have called this this is from their own range because it's got their like own little label with the white and the red and this is up for grabs long reach grabber they only did it in blue which i'm actually fine so basically you've got these little prongs on the end plastic this is all plastic and then you've got this little handle here so you squish the handle I had to try a few out of these out in the shop because the prongs were not sitting together. They were a bit wonky. For a pound, you I know, that's why I was like looking around. You can't really complain for the money it is. Why I got this was in our front garden because they're obviously still like doing bits and bobs to the house. We've obviously got to do a snagging list and there's just bits and bits of rubbish all about. I bought this to do our front garden when it's a bit nicer weather and you can just pick up all the rubbish because I'm not being funny. There's just stuff I don't want to pick up with my hands. I know I can wash them after, but this is just going to be a lot easier. So I'll just get a rubbish bag and grab it with my little prong, anything I don't want in our front garden, just to tidy a little bit up when the nicer weather comes in. And that's what it was for. And I couldn't believe that I was like thinking I wanted one of these. And I, and I found one in the pound shop for a pound. I was like, my mum's like, why do you need that? And I was like, well, the front garden looks a bit of a mess. I want to clean it up when it's nicer weather. This is just perfect. And yeah, works good. I'm just going to show you my next item really quickly because I've actually showed you this 10 times before. Like banana hair mask. And it's fab. This is a fab little mask. So I'll just go quickly through this because in case you are new on this channel, but this is great. I got one of these the other day from my friend. I picked up another one. I did find it at Ridgey and B&M or Home Bargains. Same price, same everything, but this is great to go on your hair. Lovely, lovely, lovely. So this is XHC Expel Hair Care Banana Hair Mask. There is 250 ml in here. Use a blend of ingredients created to revitalize and nourish your hair it's just amazing it smells like banana there's a lot of banana things in here today but i thought i'd pick another one up and it just i don't know if you can absolutely see that just about it's it's a i think it's a dupe it's a bit more stronger scented a bit more like like runnier but it's a dupe for the Body Shop Banana Hair Mask. I love that hair mask too, but that's so expensive. I think that my hair mask is like £10, where this is like £1. There's a big difference. I love both hair masks, but there is a big difference in price there. But this is great. So if you ever go in Poundland and you want a hair mask, please go in there and get a banana one. I don't know if you saw my channel before. This is an existing item as well. I explained that I watched another Poundland haul, like i'm doing here i watch them too just get inspiration or if there's cases something in there i've missed but i got this from inspiration from another youtuber and basically they said this perfume smells really nice it sits really nice and it's really good for the price and it is and i don't normally buy perfume from poundlands because i generally think that perfume does not always work but I bought one of these a little while back and I've used quite a bit of it. Like I use it when I go out, it's just easy, it's cheap, it's nice, it sits on me well, it doesn't give me a reaction or anything. Maybe if you have sensitive skin, just be a little bit careful. But this is what it is. So I picked another two up. You're gonna think, why the hell did you pick another two up? I picked another two up 
because when I bought the first one, I went in Poundland after to pick another one up because I loved it so much. There's not been any in there for ages. They've not had a restock until now. This is very, very like, and lots of people are liking this. So it's the Black Dusk one. I just love the aesthetics of the packet and everything. It just looks really nice. It's a uh, De Perfume spray for women, 100 ml in here. And this smells incredible, incredible. I've not had any compliments about it at the moment. I've just sprayed it on, but it's just a really sweet perfume. So I picked two up and then my mum was like, oh my God, is that perfume really, really good? And I said, yeah, I picked it up before. I use it all the time. It's just like simple as body spray. I'm not fussed if I lose it. I'm not fussed if it breaks. Like generally it's one of them good ones. And she was like, okay, I'm gonna pick one up as well. So I promoted it to my mum. So hopefully you guys will like it and maybe go and get it too. But if you like sweet sort of perfumes, you will absolutely love this. So if you do see it, please do get a couple because they do run out really quick. Next, I got some hair colors from Poundland. I originally got some in there before and they were, they're really good. I still like them. I still buy them, but that I'm sure they were originally a pound. And then they've gone up to two pound, which is not breaking the bank. If you buy two boxes of it, it's still four pound and it's cheap, still cheaper than going to a hairdresser or going to an actual professional like salon place. I did go to Sally's, that's a great place by the way. I will go there again. They are really expensive and the items are coming up to like 15, 20 pound and it's like, mm, okay. Any ado, I swapped this up because I was looking through and I was gonna pick the original ones up there. I wanted two boxes for four pound. Then I saw these and I thought, you know what? I'm gonna give these a go because I don't understand how they can be any different. So they are. And these were only a pound each. This is a Pro Color Plus hair color. This is in four dark browns. So this is gonna probably be a little bit darker than I normally want it, but I thought, yeah. I was gonna go for the darkest brown, but I, normally that can go black on my hair. So we'll try this one and see what this comes out like. We'll see how long it lasts. I can do a video if you want. If you wanna see, like I can do it, the process of how I do my hair. I haven't done one of them for a long, long time. And you can see what they're actually like. And when I can film it a couple of days later and then show you the process of if it's washed out quite a lot or not, that's up to you. Let me know but down below, I can do that. So I'll keep that on the back of my back burner. But nourishing conditioner, long lasting natural color that leaves hair silky soft with a healthy shine. In which with aloe vera and jabbar, Joba, Joba oil up to 100% grey coverage is a permanent colour. I'll open one of these up for you. It's just the same as normal. We get a bottle with the peroxide in it, and then you get the colour, and then there's a little packet in there for conditioner, and then there is like the little gloves you get. And I thought, why not? Let's go, let's go and try this for a pound. At the end of the day, what can go wrong? It's nothing like different. Like there's nothing thing. It's just not a professional color. It's just not got a big old brand name on it. But at the end of the day, it might still do the same and be better. I'm gonna try this and I will keep, like I said, in the back burner and doing a video and show you what this is actually like. It's another item I have got to do a video, but I'm a little bit scared. So please comment down below if anyone has tried these because I am genuinely scared of trying them and it is forward. Why I got these was because I've been doing sort of a serum in the day and then a cream at night and my skin has got a lot, lot better. But when I've been looking at my skin, my pores around my nose are so, so bad. It's unbelievable. I thought, you know what? I've tried the lip mask out. I've tried the under eye ones. And why not try some nose pore strips at the end of the day? If they're gonna work, then they might be great. I will tell you in a minute why I'm scared. So these are the Derma V10 Innovations. They're pretty new, they're saying, love yourself for less. Six deep, cleansing charcoal nose pore strips with hazel and peppermint oil. So the deep cleansing action draws out 
impurities surface of skin unclogs pores draws out impurities absorbs dirt and oil remove blackheads and for all skin types I've just never tried these because I've never looked at my nose and thought oh I need to but at the moment I've been looking at my pores and I'm thinking mm, my nose pores are really really bad I've known about these for a little while it's just the fact I'm a little bit scared to put them on my nose and then it pulls my skin because I'm not quite sure it says for the best results you use one one to two times a week wow so that's quite a lot isn't it really and then allow the strip to dry for approximately 10 to 15 minutes and that's the bit I'm scared for for the fact I will put it on my nose and then it will proper pull my nose the only thing I can do is try it I will try it as a video and if it goes wrong then you will know if I don't post the video but if it goes right and they're really good then I will let you know if it goes wrong as well and they don't do what they're meant to do I will say that as well I'm not gonna just promote something that's really really good all the time if something is really rubbish I will tell you as well and if it hurt me or pull my skin off I will let you know I just don't want to cross fingers but I will try them out. If anyone has tried these out or any nose strips before, please let me know how you get on down below. That would be absolutely great. Fortunately, we have come to the end of the Poundland video. There was quite a few existing products and quite a few new ones. So I hope you did like it. I hope you did like the video and I hope you did like the advice I've given you. If you did, then give it a massive thumbs up, like I said at the beginning of the video, because it helps me out. It helps me to know what you guys like and want to see. Also, if you are new, then come and join the little love family and subscribe to Taswell's 12 by hitting the subscribe button. Comment down below. I just want to say that I'm not sponsored by Poundland or any brands I did show you. This is all out of my own money and advice video for you guys. That is everything. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching and have a lovely day or a lovely evening and I will see you soon guys. Bye.